Along with a captivating storyline, tender moments featuring kissing scenes have the ability to elevate the charm and excellence of a tale of love. Even with attractive leads and a captivating soundtrack, a romantic drama can still feel incomplete without those scenes. We know that a lot of Chinese dramas with romantic scenes with skinship and dreamy kissing scenes, but here we have gathered some best 10 Chinese dramas with a lot of steamy kissing scenes even with their long episodes you will find it was worth the wait. 10. Till the end of the moon, 2023. Till the End of the Moon is a Xianxia drama that stands out with a high budget, outstanding casts, and stunning costumes. The plot revolves around defying destiny, discovering the true essence of love, and selecting your own journey, making it a captivating, emotional, and exquisite experience. But, certain important details were removed due to censorship restrictions, which resulted in confusing events that lacked thorough explanations. Even with the wuxia theme, it is undeniable that the exceptional method of storytelling in this drama is what truly distinguishes it and gives it its beauty. In the drama, Bai Lu plays Li Susu, who witnesses the destruction caused by the evil devil god, portrayed by Luo Yunxi. Li Susu was sent back to eliminate the malevolent fetus, Tan Tai Jin, who poses a threat to everything. Although Tan Tai Jin's character is sympathetic, Li Susu must remain focused on her purpose to protect the Three Realms, even if it means putting her own feelings aside. This creates a conflict between love, hate, and duty, which adds to the drama's intensity. Nine, falling into your smile, 2021. Falling into your smile is an ideal drama for fans of romantic comedies. It is based on the web novel You're Beautiful When You Smile by Ching Mei and explores the world of esports, a professional online gaming sport that has gained popularity worldwide, particularly in China. Falling into your smile, focus on the romantic relationship between the two main characters, Lu Xiqing, played by Su Kai, and Tong Yao, played by Qing Xia. And as a highlight you will see the strong bonds of friendship between ZGDX members, showcasing the many aspects of true friendship, such as trust, teamwork, and forgiveness. The bromance adds a light-hearted touch to the series, providing moments of laughter and joy. Who Rules the World is a captivating tale that blends traditional wuxia with grandiose palace politics, epic warfare, and romantic love. This immersive story takes place in a vivid Jianghu that transcends the boundaries of the Seven Kingdoms. It follows the relationship between two esteemed martial artists, Hei Fengxi played by Yang Yang and Bai Fengxi played by Zhao Lusi, as they navigate through the treacherous world of ancient politics and pugilistic rivalries. The story is filled with characters who are determined to rule the world, making it an exciting adventure. The story is based on the best-selling 2007 novel Chiaxer Tian Xia also known as Let's Try the World which was written by prolific period romance novelist Qing Lingyu. The plot of Who Rules the World is straightforward and the characters are well-developed. The range of emotions, humor, fight scenes, and dialogue are mature enough to be relatable without causing frustration. Well, even the drama is not perfect, but the chemistry between Yang Yang and Zhao Lusi is so sweet and overwhelming. Seven, Lighter Princess, 2022.
Adapted from the novel The Lighter and the Princess Gown, written by Twentine, Lighter Princess is a typical high school romance. It may sound cliché, but when you start to watch this drama, you will be drawn by the emotions. The enemies to lovers drama with a whole package and perfect mixes with a slow burn but realistic and natural romance with comedy, angsty, friendship, and betrayal. There are life lessons to learn from each character. This is a story about Zhu Yun, played by Zhang Jingyi. Her university life just began, but it was disrupted by the arrival of bad boy Li Sun, played by Qin Fei Yu. Li Sun, who appears like a wanton good for nothing. But actually, he is a programming genius. He appears distant and unapproachable to most people, but interestingly, he is not that way towards Zhu Yun. Zhu Yun and Li Sun have a good natured competition, and it becomes clear that Zhu Yun has a unique impact on Li Sun. As they collaborate and pursue their aspirations, they develop romantic feelings for each other. Unfortunately, their happiness is short lived as a tragedy suddenly strikes. Six, love and redemption. Hey, you, you, this woman, what? What are you doing? You dirty clothes. I'll wash your clothes. Love and Redemption were adapted from the Chinese novel The Glass Maiden, and it has parts similar to those of Ashes of Love and Ten Miles of Peach Blossoms. A good drama with the usual setting of the three realms, the heavenly court with its powerful beings like gods and immortals, the mortal realm with its cultivators, and the underworld realm with demons and devils. Even with that, no one can not resist the feeling of love and hate and all the feelings in between. We are all diverse and yet still the same, loving to watch this genre. Love and Redemption is certainly epic and memorable love story. Ching Yi as Yu Si Feng and Yuan Bing Yan as Zhu Xian Ji have amazing chemistry, and their acting can truly make us feel the character's happiness, sorrow, anger, and pain. The drama revolves around Xian Ji, a young woman born without her six senses, and Si Feng, a young man cursed never to fall in love. Five, you are my glory. Twenty twenty one. 白天忍一下，别睡，把作息调整过来。那你晚上又不让我好好睡觉。你说对。Although the love story between a celebrity and a normal person isn't anything new in drama land, you are my glory has a simple but unique story. The drama is frustration free. There are no mean exes, no annoying family members causing problems, and no unnecessary conflicts in the entertainment industry. This is what you consider the best drama romantic comedy package, with no unnecessary details, and it is just perfect. This is simplicity at its finest, full-on fluff for the majority of the episodes. Also, with Yang Yang and Dilraba Dilmarat in one frame is a beautiful blessing to our eyes. You Are My Glory is adapted from the novel Mangu. The slow burn romance between you two, an intellectual with his own flaws, and Jingjing, a famous actress, that used to like you two when they were in high school. The drama spans from when the two leads met again and some flashbacks in high school when the two became friends and they began to falling in love. Ten Miles of Peach Blossoms is such a compelling and beautiful drama with a brilliant story. Every single thing in this drama is so stunning from costumes, set, cinematography, spectacular acting, and beautiful love story. Yang Mi did a fantastic job as always, and the way Mark Chow skillfully portrays two characters, Yi Hua and Mo Yuan, with differing traits, behaviors, and responses is truly commendable, showcasing his outstanding acting talent. You could feel their love and pain and share their happiness. The kiss scenes are very good too. The plot focuses on two divine beings, Yi Hua and Bai Qian. 
They get separated, but destiny brings them back together in different lives three times. A journey that will leave a lasting impression, characterized by intense feelings, thrilling adventures, and impactful occurrences. It is challenging to foresee the subsequent occurrences in this show due to its 58 gripping episodes, but each episode will give you captivating storylines. Three, Love Between Fairy and Devil, 2022. Love Between Fairy and Devil is a Chinese fantasy drama that tells the story of a classic forbidden romantic relationship between a fairy and a devil. This drama has all the typical elements of a Xianxia drama, forbidden love, being born again, a cold male lead falling in love with a warm and lively female lead, which becomes his only vulnerability, and a female lead with a secret identity, and more. But what sets this drama apart from other Xianxia dramas is its exceptionally stunning visuals, graphics, and cinematography. The way it was presented and how it incorporated its fantasy elements made it feel fresh and engaging. With the starring Li Ju Shuxin and Dylan Wang, this drama tells about an immortal girl from the Paexian tribe who had her tribe vanquished by the demon lord. Reborn as Xiao Lanhua, an immortal from the heavenly tribe, she regained life 10,000 years later, albeit in a minor role. Lan Hua unintentionally rescued Dongfang Qingzong, her mortal enemy, after he was trapped in the Hao Tian Tower. In order to attain freedom, Dongfang Qingzong intends to utilize Xiao Lan Hua's immortal soul to eliminate the curse from his own physical form. In the process, the heartless demon falls for the gentle and adorable young fairy. Meet Yourself, 2023. Meet Yourself is like a gem. It breaks away from the conventional fast-paced style, presenting a unique and unconventional drama. It resembles a love that matures at an ideal pace. It's so moving, warm and makes you experience what's shown in it. With an excellent story, cast, music, cinematography, and setting, the drama will ease you into a journey of healing and soul-searching, and it will linger in your heart for a very long time. Starring Liu Yifei and Li Xian, Meet Yourself is the story of Su Hong Do, a nearly 35-year-old office worker who faced a major obstacle in life as her dear friend succumbed to cancer. Feeling distressed and unable to come to terms with her friend's passing, Su chose to leave her job and take a long rest in a made-up countryside village called Yun Miao, a place her best friend had really wanted to go to. She subconsciously begins her journey to discover the meaning and way of life. One, Hidden Love, 2023. Hidden Love is an adorable, captivating, and heartwarming youth romance drama. This drama has some elements similar to other love stories, but it stands out by telling a heartfelt story, developing the characters in a nuanced way, and bringing some new elements to the genre. The play successfully combines sweet romantic moments, family scenes, and young people's experiences, which all strongly affect the audience. It is based on a book with the same title. The story revolves around a young girl, Sang Ji, played by Zhao Lucy, and her secret admiration for her brother's friend, Duan Jiaxu, played by Qin Ji Yuan. Sang Ji and Duan Jiaxu first met when Sang Ji was only 14 years old. They met again when Sang Ji was 17, and during this time, Sang Ji started to develop feelings for Duan Jiaxu. Jiaxu, who was five years older than him, only saw her as his little sister. However, she always held a special role in his life as part of their family. They have some time apart before eventually reuniting with each other. A lovely and thrilling tale commences as she enters adulthood, complete with magnetism and a profound bond that is bound to evoke feelings of excitement and passion.
Thank you for watching this video. Help me by subscribing to my channel and tell me what is your favorite steamy kissing drama in the comments below.